So as is so often the case in these Let's Plays, I have to correct myself for some statements I made in, in some of the earlier entries, um, now that I've done a little bit more research about the game. Uh, I was a little bit mistaken. I, this is not actually a PC exclusive. It is actually also available for the PlayStation 4, um, which kind, kind of, uh, it goes hand in hand with just the graphical quality that we're seeing. It is Unreal. I think it was the, the current Unreal Engine. Is it Frostbite, I think? Um, I really don't know enough about the technical side, as I probably should. But, uh, let's uh, check our options real quick. Make sure that it sounds not too loud. It sounds a little bit high. Yep, there we go. You guys are probably having a hard time hearing me. Bam. Sorry about that. Should be a little bit better. Again, I keep on uh, apologizing for the status of uh, my, my sound recording. And I keep on saying that I'm eventually going to fix it. I promise I will. <laughs> uh, I have my eye on a microphone that would do me serve me quite well. And hopefully I'll be pulling the trigger on that relatively soon. Okay, so we've just solved our first real puzzle, I guess. Or our real mystery. Ooh, there's some red lights over there, it seems like. Let's investigate that. Are those just artifacts, or are those actually something lighting up? I'm not sure. But we have the freedom to explore pretty much wherever we want. That's uh, it's quite liberating. Whoa! People come here for many reasons. They want to ask me questions about the future. I can see the future. So it is the past that interests me. If you want to find my house, you must answer the questions I ask of you. Okay. Does death bring peace or suffering? Would you rather be a leaf or a root? Do you love for yourself or for others? A beautiful woman sat by a river. A witch approached and told the woman she was to have a child. The woman began to cry with joy, but the joy turned to fear and she could not stop crying. Fear turned to sadness. The woman continued to cry. She cried for months, hardly sleeping, until the child was born. But the crying had aged the woman, and she was no longer beautiful. When he was old enough, her son climbed the mountain to find the home of the witch. He asked her if she could make, if he, she could make his mother beautiful again. The witch asked the boy many questions. After hearing the answers, the witch told the boy she had lied to the mother about her child. The boy disappeared, and the mother was beautiful again. Wow, that's bizarre. Ethan, the point of life is not to rock the boat. Just try to get along. Stop living in your head. Do something real. That's what people respond to. Reality. Ethan, honey, I'm sorry I yelled at you. I want you to keep this note and read it every time I lose my temper. I don't mean it, and no, I got a snake's tongue. You're my little guy, my precious bean. You just gotta pull your head out of them clouds, okay? Love, Mom. Hmm. So we have this strange little hovel out here. Well, our last clue was that uh, Ethan was heading towards the uh, the tunnels, um, which I believe we've already passed through. So we just got to figure out how to make our way back over there. Kind of just explore here. Can't see. It seems I can't drop off of this edge in this ravine.
And again, I feel like the, uh, it's, it's hard to say whether this is really open world or not, because as I said, it, it, uh, it's more of a collection of these very specifically tuned and, and tailored um, experiences in these areas. Uh, but it certainly has open world elements. And uh, I think it works. I think it works very well, uh, even though I've been pretty wary of open world.